and Max B. Right. Producer, you. artist extraordinaire. Al. Hi. Boo. Now, you are Dan Grief. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Uh, do you, um, hi, oh, wow. Max B. Got all the hugs and whatnot. Nice to meet you all, so both of you. Oh, wow. <laughs> all right, fellas, have a seat right over here. And here we are. Rural Music and Stars today. Right. Yeah, I can't figure right. out, you know, you guys, how it is. Max, that you can still be late. I'm sure I'll be the traveler. I'm in this. Hey now, it is bad. It is bad. How nice to see you, fellas. Oh, my phone. How are you doing? Now, Dave, they tell me that you don't. That you don't. I can't hit. Hello. Nice to have you, Thomas. Oh, I'm sorry. Here's your headphones. I'm sorry. Here's your headphones. Sorry. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah you guys ready? Yes. Oh, and I can't hear your microphone. Yep, one, two, one, two, one, two. Look at that, ghost. Come on, yeah. I can't, one, two, one, I can't. Two. Look, look, look. Oh. <laughs> it's broken. Oh. Ah. Right. Well, I can That's okay. We can, um, oh, there you go, Grease. So, one, um, two. oh, right. wow. That's right. Well over modulated. Right. So now we're fans of yours here on the show. Mm -hmm. Dame Grease. Oh, Dame, Dame, Dame. Dame. You gotta give him the history, man. He was responsible for the Rough Rider sound in the beginning. Yeah, right. you worked. Uh, you worked with um, everybody from like the Wu Tang Clan to Nas and, and all kinds of people in between. DMX is Dark and Hell is Hot. I did crafted that album. My first song I put on was Trigger and Biggie. We always loved to pop it. Okay. That's my first song. Then my second single was If You Think I'm Jiggy. Then my third big single and the whole big album was Get At Me Dog and Whole Exile. Look at you. Mm. Right. So why why do you choose to stay so in the background as opposed to being more on the forefront? At, at the first part of my career, you know, I, I really played the back. You know what I'm saying? I just pushed the buttons, got the checks, and went home. Yeah. But now, like you know, what I'm saying to my mature part of the career, you know. Well, now that now that you see people like Timberland and other people right. playing the front, and perhaps this is I mean, there's room for all of you all. You know, if you're good, there's room for all of you. But you yes. you realize that you you missed out on a lot of spotlight. You got some catching up to do. Right. What do you think about Swiss Beats and Timberland and, and the, the producers? Well, you, you got I mean, you got you know a couple of them is great. A couple of them is cool. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. Who's know? great to you? Hmm. <laughs> I mean, you and who else? Now, um, right. Um. Oh, who's horrible? Uh. Who's marginal? Oh. Who's overrated? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> okay. No sir. <laughs> he got some heaters out there now. He did the Fed taking pictures. Yeah. Right drum. now I got on DJ Drama for a single Fed taking pictures of us out. Did the Rock Billionaires for Freeway Very yeah. nice. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Very nice. So Max B, now you, uh, my friend, you had a falling out with Jim Jones, right? Yeah, we had our um, mutual differences. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me just let me just ask you. Well, you know, I saw Max in the club about a couple of months ago, and Max was like, "Yo, you want me to come up there and out, Jim?" Hell yeah! Max out, actually. Let, okay, look. Now I hate that both of you all are late, but we're gonna I'm get sorry. this from you. No, nope. I'm sorry, Grease. We're gonna play tag team back and forth. Yes. Look, Max B. Now I'm a resident of Jersey, and I know that uh, you had a little uh, arrest that went down on like Route Four or something like Before that. Before me. Not familiar, not familiar with the area. Okay. Explain <laughs> the explain the night. Huh? I wasn't there. Oh, you weren't there, but you were you did get arrested. Explain what happened that night. I can't. <laughs> okay. Did did Jim Jones bail, bail you out? No. Of who, who bailed you out? A la my manager my current manager now, her name's Jalay Moore. She bailed me out. How much was your bail? It was one point five, but then they when we had came up with it, they made us go back in and do some other shit. So uh, yeah, you can't curse. It made us go back in and put up another joint. So it really came out to two mil. Okay. But it was one point five. So, so where, where was it Jim? Was, it was two mil. It was two mil of property, and then I needed then I needed like ten percent cash of that. So we came up with like six percent cash of that. Mm -hmm. That's where Jim came in. Well, I heard two he didn't pay. That wasn't his cash. Like I had to give up songs for that cash in exchange. So wait a minute. So what was the video with him counting the money, saying he was about to that go was the, That was the ten percent with cash he was coming to get me with. That I, I know you don't think he was counting two million. It's just right there with no money machine. Like right there before he was, it looked it like juicy like that. But that that was that that's how he make it look like it's extra. But you know. Are you cool with games. him? Are you cool with him? No, no, no. no. How they go from? I wouldn't say how that. they go from sweet to sour so quick though. Cause dudes don't dudes don't care about me. Dudes want me to work for free, and and I got responsibilities. Like I'm 30 years old, and I'm saying I got a son. Like I need money too. Like dudes want me to work for free. You know, dudes got accustomed to that. You know what I'm saying when I came home, I had a little buzz. Dudes like yo Max, man, what's up? Like you gonna go back to working for this? How long mm -hmm. were you in jail? 
On this one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How long were you in jail this this particular time, Max? I did ten months. Okay, so, and then and then so you've been out for how long? About like a year, I think. Good for you. This case still pending, though. Yeah, I'm still, I still. And and so, were you in a club in Newark and Jim ran up on you? Yeah, they tried. Okay, <laughs> talk, talk about that. When did we that heard, We heard he roughed that you was, up a little bit. No, 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 no. That's no, what we heard. No, 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 no. <laughs> That's not true. That's to the total opposite. They tried to rough me up. They tried to get crazy, but I had my guys in order. Everything was in order. Right they were Got a hair on my chinny chin chin. Yeah. So where do you, I mean, what happens when you see him out? Do you ever, is that I don't see him. No, I don't see him. Who's calling you? That's my guy, Hot. Oh, hi, Hot. Yeah, that's Hot. You know, I don't see him. I might get prank callers and stuff like that, but I don't pay that no mind. Like, I'm a G. Like, I got like 50 guys downstairs right now waiting for something to go down. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I'm gonna be like, you know. <laughs> Max, what's your take on on that? And, and when I did that ten months, like I wasn't in PC unit, like I was running through the three building, like in pop, like, like I'm. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't. <laughs> I hope you already shot the video, Dan. Yeah. For Connecticut, Kush. What did you What did you say? You're running through like in pop? Running through. Mm -hmm. oh, everything. Okay. I was just involved. Like, oh, you were involved. I wasn't, I wasn't right, like, right, right, right. I was involved. Right. Like, wow. I was back in. I was prepared to stay. I didn't even think I was gonna get out. Word the mother. Like, okay. At first, I thought I thought dude was gonna come hold me down, but then like after I, did, after I went to Jersey and dude didn't come get me and my bell got dropped. Gotcha. I said, oh, these dudes trying to, they try to leave me in here and steal my music. I know I left like a hundred songs in the drive. <laughs> That's what they doing now. But I'm out here doing it. So they lip singing. I came up with the lip sync concept. For Public Domain 3. For, for PD3, all the lip singing. Hosted by Who Kid. Um, executive produced by me and Dave Grease. The world loves me. And I got and I got 2.5 coming out Thursday too with Lazy K. Shout out to Lazy K. That's another just bomb. I'm going to just bomb on them with that one too. So it's like... Are you caught up in with, with paperwork and stuff with Jim? Cause you know you got the whole burger. Yeah, 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 but he's like, still eating off of you. He don't eat cause I don't. I don't. Do, he's not eating. He's not doing nothing. He's keep quiet right now. Everything he trying to do, like I was responsible for everything you heard, Jim, in the last two, year, three years. I was responsible for that. So I he was, was ghostwriting for Jim. I was the man kicking out the hits, making the hooks, making helping verses and doing this and all picking the beats and standing in the studio twelve hours a night making all the songs. So now what they doing that I don't mess with them no more. From what I the wait. songs that's left over, they got the they got a kid in there now that that was on with the Henny joint with me. The kids, you know what I'm talking about? They got him trying to sound like me singing. So my because you've been on before. practically everything except for maybe balling, right? Yeah, I have write that too. Okay, mm -hmm. all right. It's Max B. It's Dame Grease. They're late, but I gotta get to the we gotta get to the bottom of it. So we'll take a break and then you guys come back. Okay, that's the bottom. we're taking a quick break. Going no, music stars today. We're going right. deeper. Let's get deep. Okay. All right, we'll be back. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that dude do sound like you though. Neo, oh, whatever his name is, the Matrix, whatever his name is. Hey, can you open the door just so I can um tell? Hey, um, Jordan! Hey, can you can walk the guys back in at 44, I need them back. So at 43, you start making the walk again. Because we have two months. All right, just follow um, Jordan. Thanks, guys.